welcome you to the big day out, the day of the year, beyond any doubt. With Nick the golden boy strutting the stage, what a fantastic rage. There's skating, markets and food galore, amusements, the boiler room and lots, lots more. There's rancid tism and tumbleweed, unbelievable indeed. In 96, we've got new tricks with Dirty Three and Regurgitator. And Perry's pornos wow the whole mob when they come on later. So let's all set Australasia alive. Across the land, it's no ordinary jive. For that's what showbiz is all about. It's all in the big day out.
Ja, maar wel fijn, hè? Mate. My name's Stuart Bates. I've just come up here for the day for the coast, back in Sunshine Coast. Right, and are you having a good day? It's been good, it's been good. Is all that kind of pain worth it, mate? It's, it's worth it, I reckon, yeah. Will I've you be got... going back for more? I will be. I've got to find a toilet to wash it all through, and then I'll be back for more. You seem to have a bit of a twinge of an English accent there, mate. You wouldn't yep. be in a band, would you? I wouldn't be in a band, but... Are you I'm a soccer hooligan? I am a soccer hooligan. You're a soccer hooligan. Yep. And then we'll get on to the rest of this shit, okay? Because I'm really scared because my brother pissed off. Okay, here we go. Throw the coat out. And, and just got it. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Harold, the coat hanger with certain pain. 
Um, he will feature at the end of the show. Lubricated. <laughs> I'm trying not to hurt myself. Okay. We're gonna do a bit of a gangster song for you. I know we're from Australia and all that, but it's only a bit, a bit of fun, eh? I don't know if I can play this with my finger. <laughs> Place history, mate. I'm um, I'll go witness Will you marry me? Yes. <laughs> You're joking! Yes. It's unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> Magic change the beach do come true. Big day out, that's what it's all about. Magic. You know, you can feel it in the air, can't you? Love. You're the guy out of ministry, aren't you? Curly no. L. 
Jorgensen. Al Jorgensen. Yeah, Al Jorgensen. No, that's just an alias I go by occasionally at times from time Right, time. because you could, I mean, you'd pass off as you said. Oh, well, I know. A lot of people said that to me before, hey, I was really sort of a bit shocked. People used to say this to me a lot, hey, you look like Al Jorgensen from Ministry. And I said, yeah, nah, wicked, nah. Hey. Well, it's a, bit, a bit more like you love the Afro, hey? And, you know, you like know what's giving you away, though? The Forex, mate. I oh, know, they've got no, no fucking, they've got no VB here, mate. It's, that's that's is that your timetable like at school? No. When's your that's free today. period in between? That's the, today. Is it? Yeah. And who are you here to see? Everyone. Everyone. I think this is fantastic. You are the first sober person we've met here today. <laughs> yeah, who are you here to see, mate? What? Oh. No, I don't know, man. You I, don't know anything I, about the chicks bands? Or what? No, I'm just, just like the festival carnival For the feel big of it day all. out, man. Right, That's what it's and all so about, you actually it? don't know anything about the bands? Oh, I know who's on. Like, who's on there? Tism's on, man. So you're a fan of Tism's? Oh, I don't mind a few of their songs. Yeah, great. Which ones? Oh, fuck, man. Don't ask me the names, no. I don't. You couldn't sing one for us, could you? No. Just sort of, you know, a bit of a. Uh, no, not that on. energetic, man. Just Abusive, and his mom prefers the daughter. I know he's got an attention deficiency disorder. He's culturally excluded, and he's genetically impaired. But the reason he's a homeboy is because he's a dickhead. Tell me why. Tell me why, tell me why He's a homeboy Tell me why, tell me why Your class, your race, your age, your face determines your social station. Baseball cap and a love of rap might need sympathy, but still, possibly a whole boy could be a dickhead, pure and simple. Tell me why, tell me why, tell me why. What Jesus Christ once knew They changed their minds that they will They met a homeboy crew Seed secret to our continued success. Well, Martin is slicing, <laughs> slicing a mango. Black and white, black and white wild stuff.
That's your rum. That's your rum. It's made by. A lot of ice. While that's being blended, Mick Harvey is going to play. Like that. He does things like that. Things like that. Uh, so, yeah, this is Jim, Jim Sklavunas, who is our percussionist. Last return. And okay. probably the most, the better looking member of the band. Thank you. There's Martin Casey, who still refuses to be uh, our bass player. Harvey here, he's the, uh, he's in the bad seats, he plays guitar, we've been uh, friends and uh, professional colleagues since we were about 14 years old, almost 25 years we've been working together. Hey, sir, you look like a surfer. He does. Hold on. Can you surf on that window? Yeah, I'm trying to be leaving up here. Yeah. Are you why? Cyclone season. It's going to be happening in the next few days. Oh really? Well, we can surf everywhere we're going, right? Or no? Yeah, it's crowded. Great, crowded. Do you know where we can surf where it's not crowded? Talk to me, I'll do some. We okay? Let's not look up where you stay. Uh, you know what? Oh, we're all in the same hotel? In Kuchi? Yeah, my Kuchi. name's Guido. Think of a Zippo lighter. Yeah. Guido Zippo. Guido Zippo. Yeah. Jesus, that's a good Whoa. Yeah. Guido Zippo. What are you doing there, man? What am I doing there? I'm putting lighter fluid in my lighter. Right, and, uh, right. I just like fire. Blow the fire, get burnt. Yeah. So you want to do some surfing? Yeah, I do. I got a killer board Rusty gave me. I'm sponsored by Rusty. You see the uh, watch? Yeah. And I have a hat too. Sponsor gear. Big sponsorship agreement. 
Yeah. Utah sponsorship agreement, a watch and a hat. Yeah. That's good. And board. They gave me a uh, brand new surfboard. Six oh, Whoa! Gaffy, who are you sponsored by? Bar board. and Surf Shop. And they gave me a surf shirt. Yeah. And oh, they gave me a hat. They gave me a sweater. Yeah. They gave me glasses, these glasses. Yeah. Right, yeah. Good people. Right. Scammer Sam. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even have to scam. <laughs> <laughs> And they took me surfing on top of it. Jesus. All I had to do was give them backstage. That's all. That is. And That's all. Yeah. Why else would they do it? Not because they like it. Because I'm Kelly Slater. Yeah. And they like it. I slept with Kelly Slater. What? You slept with, with Kelly Slater? Yeah. You and my girl both. Now, uh, this is Sydney. That's Sydney Harbour Bridge. which the English must have looked on in awe when they discovered this town. That's the opera house described by Barry Humphreys as a drowning nun. Hello, Mum. How are you, darling? Yeah, I just ring to see how you are. I'm being filmed at the moment. They're making a uh, documentary of this and they're filming me on the telephone with my mother. And I just wanted to say that I loved you and that you're the greatest mum in the world. What are you doing? Blixer, are you happy being in the bad seats? Yes. Would you trade it in for another band? Would I trade it in for something else? Like if Robert Smith asked you to be the guitarist of The Cure. <laughs> yeah. Have you been before? No, it's my first one. First time. Do you think your life will be the same after this one? No, I don't think so. Absolutely. I want you to really go hard, destroy yourself, and get up feeling shit tomorrow. Because that's the whole part of it. Forget the rock and roll, forget the big day out, just go and kill yourself. <laughs>
I'll never forget the first day I met her But that September morning was clear and fresh The way she spoke and laughed at my jokes And the way she rubbed herself against the edge of my desk She became a magic mystery to me and we Sit together in double street twice a week and some days we'd walk the same way home It's surprising how quick a little rain can clear the streets We dreamed of her and compared our dreams But that was all that I ever tasted For she lied to me with her body, you see And I lied to myself about the chances I wasted Times we were close, we were far and few between. The darkness of the dances in the school canteen. Did she close her eyes as I did? And we held each other tight. And la 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 means I love you. <laughs> Dance with me and I still hold that memory soft and sweet And I whistle up at her window as I walk down the street But I never made the first team, I just made the first team laugh And she never came to the phone, she was always in the bath In the end it took me a dictionary to find out the meaning of Unrequited what she was giving herself for free The party to which I was never invited I never understood my failings then And I hide my humble hopes now Thinking back folks, she made us wonder The girl not old enough to shave her wonder wall
Hans Mayer. eccentrics really that are allowed to exist in rock and roll and they're the people that I think what it really is all about people like you, um, Thank you. how do you feel how do you feel about how do I feel well I feel like uh, you know if I had my way uh, ha Halloween would exist every single day because I just love to just like look at people that are just like uh, free and so, um, you know, if they're not going to do it, then I guess I will. And, um, uh, you know what I mean? Thank you. 
He's a ghost, he's a god, he's a man, he's a guru. Your one microscopic cog in his catastrophic plan, designed and directed by his red right hand.
Sydney is had to pay a former councillor over one million dollars. When the tremor up the court, the Supreme Court judge is today at interest to the original amount. In February 1990, this... So we're, we're, um, we're at least halfway through the tour now. How do you think it's going? Financially, Howard, how do you think it's going? Is there anything to do with you? It's OK. It'll be all right. It's all right. We're I've got enough money. for drinks and cigarettes. We'll be OK. Well, we've got Rebecca. She's always got the credit card, so and it's a sad when one. when we need, we can always come to the Banco de Bull Bank of the Bull guy. Banco de Bull guy. <laughs> we have exceptional lending rates. We do a mortgage plan, we do a retirement plan, we've got a superannuation fund. You wouldn't believe the super fund is fantastic. You give me 400 a week, and at 55 years of age, I'll give you a grand. Cash. <laughs> <laughs> One tear, come on, Colin, you can do it. I'm trying, I'm trying. Tell me a sad story. Tell me about the nana who had a toe chopped off by a shopping trolley. These electronic devices can interfere. Matt, why don't you come and sit over here and let this little girl have your seat? Right yeah, here do that, Matt. Come on, Matt. Sorry, 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 Matt Crosby's moving. It's one of those guys from the Tizzy. <laughs> Pull these red tags down to inflate the jacket. If it doesn't inflate, use these mouthpieces. The light will come on automatically when in the water. The whistle is to attract attention. Hey, give me that plane back. <laughs> and go off. <laughs> What's it like being a drummer? It's like to be in the dark behind. But it's a physical thing, it's good. It's good for your body and mind. Yeah, it's a, it's a discipline. Yeah, you it's have to discipline. take care all the time. I remember days long ago when we used to take lots of drugs, a lot of speed. Yeah. Basically. You used to. Um, you used to hold your fists over hot flames in order to toughen up your hands and uh, <laughs> lift weights and um, had some picture and on the grind, wall too at grind home. cigarettes into your into your cheeks and stuff like that. Yeah. You've given that up now. I gave that up. We're now in Yarrawonga on our day off from the big day out. Matthew Crosby's pet fly. Get back on my shoulder, come on. <laughs> come on. Hup. Oh, we are going into the Builders Arms Hotel. Please video, they're making floor. That magical song of theirs, Everything's Fucked. Here is, in fact, Warren Ellis, my hey. dear friend. How are you, Ellis. darling? We've got about five minutes to count down, Nick. I have no idea. What are we supposed to be doing? What are we supposed to be doing? The set, what's going on? We've got five minutes. Martin Casey here on the set. Of Every, on the set here with Martin Casey, Tara Jane, Segeki on the set. With 33 shooting, everything is fucked. This is Rachel here, the Hello. lovely Rachel. Mick Geyer. Oh, this is the frame here. We're doing one shot. This is what they call in the cin cinema business, one shot. <laughs> Thank you. 
Spanish people. illicit substances.
Roland Howard is going to come along with us to the big day out. Roland's worked with me in the past. The dim distant well, past. The dim distant past and done things in the not so dim distant past. It was um, dim, it may not be that distant. It's a little dim, perhaps. Okay, it's a little dim, perhaps. But my personal viewpoint is that Roland is one of the great guitar players around, and I think I would like to see him play more guitar. Roland, I would like to see you play more guitar. Well, it was a shame you missed our gig. It was really good. When was that? Um, the day before you got back to Melbourne. It was like the first time the band had played for eight months or something ridiculous. But that's These Immortal Souls. At the Panda's Club? Yeah. Tatiana, you come and sit by me. Hello. Hi. How are you today? You look lovely. How are you today? How are you? Tired. This is my hometown. Mm. Mm. Yes. Do you like coming to Australia? You do? Yeah, a lot of German people seem to like Australia. I don't know why. It's the lure of the desert. It's the lure of the, <laughs> of the desert. <laughs> right. Um, do you know Andrea? Yes, I like her. This is Andrea here. These two girls know each other. Where's Tuesday? Alexa, are you okay? Yeah. I've still got this camera. Yeah. <laughs> you still want to He's interview? I want to interview you one day. <laughs> you do it. I want to interview what? I want to interview you one, one yeah, day, yeah. properly. You don't... Smart questions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you get the spirit. You're a very difficult man to get a hold of. But then again, you're a difficult man.
for years and years and years as, as our producer and uh, engineer and whatever yeah. in the studio. So, I'm the so, studio, that's right. It's been many, many years so, now. In fact, my teeth are falling out thinking about it. Here's the man behind the sound. I have a long time. So for a long, yeah. long time. Half deaf and mad. No, no only half mad. Record. Completely deaf. Huh? Don't push Walk me right into it. Oh, terrifying things. What a frightening <laughs> object. But I can tell stories. All I need is someone to ask the questions. Oh, what I can say is they're bloody hard people to work with. I mean, when you've got that much ego in one room, I mean, look, you could, you, you can, you could cut the ego with a knife. No, the air with a knife. No, the uh, ego. Oh, the, the ego, okay. The well. ego. It's like a chain Look, reaction sort of thing. What do you, you get, know? It's like radiation. You get too much of uh, it in one room and people start suffering fallout. That's out. it, yeah. yeah. Hair fallout, etc. I could talk about Roland recording him. We once put corrugated iron around his amp so that the sound made the fillings drop out of your teeth. And it worked. I reckon I lost a few fillings out of that sound. Sorry? Yeah, did yeah, yeah, yeah. Corrugated iron, rattling off the top end. Turn it up loud enough. Fillings out. Perfect. What more do you want? What more do the dentists of the world want? Listen, come here, come here, come here. I want you to film these people too. These are the, our absolute treasured, uh, our, our biggest fans, the Troots, the Troots. They have uh, the largest collection of Nick Cave. Whatever. You, 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 uh, tell, tell me a little bit. And uh, yes, we've been collecting for a long time and. Uh, we thank oh, Nick for it. You've been yeah. coming to my concerts for how long? Since yep, 82. And uh, it's getting better all the time. The golden disc we get. That would be so exciting. Well, no way. not going to show up, probably. You know? Yeah, I think that's 
that I haven't been happy with Jack the Ripper there at all. So, Staggerly, Do You Love Me, Eternity, We've Heard of Eternity, yeah. Boom Boom Boom, Mercy, Mercy, Ripper, Mother of the Unmade Right Hand. You know where that band's going to be? Are you fine? Good, yeah. yeah. That's the best. Yeah. 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 This is Kylie, is she? Huh? She's uh, this, yes. She's washing. <laughs> so, is that good? How are you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hello, Kylie. How are you today? <laughs> Oh, uh, I'm a hell of a lot better for seeing you. Did you hear? Did you read about us in the paper? No. Um, apparently, we're snogging. Uh, um, not enough singing and too much snogging. Fans. More, more, more snogging than singing was the thing. Fiddlesticks. Yeah. Um, oh, I haven't met you. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you, you, my mum will refuse to be photographed. Hello. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Hello. Can I just film you for a little bit? Then I'll come and. You are a Minogue. You are. This is where. This is where all the beauty comes from. How are you, Carol? I'm fine. Okay, I'm going to put this down now. Thank you. I'd like to invite now Miss Kylie Minogue to come up here and sit with me. I'm wet. I'm wet. I don't mind you wet. It's okay. This is the Wild Rose. Brought her a flower. She was more beautiful 
than any woman I've seen And I said, do you know where the wild roses grow So sweet and scarlet and free Show it's after the Melbourne show here. And I think we were contacted by extraterrestrials. Right, Pear? We heard the beep. Yeah. yeah. Three beeps. Yeah, you know what it three was? Three beeps. Yeah. It was three beeps. Because you know why? Uh, I figured out what the uh, sign, what it meant. Thing is, well, it means we're small. running out of time. Did you know that? How'd you know that? It's suitcase. It's a video camera. Two violin. Two violin. If you're a carrot, you have to wait in line. And you have to accept the fact humane. someone was going to eat you. Yeah. And you go, all right, I'll be Cheeto. food this time. Yeah, yeah. So you're Whatever carrot. happened to yeah. Jermaine and Tito? And, go, and you be a good carrot. Well, yeah. You don't be One a lousy carrot. Yeah. Yeah. A carrot you makes a person yeah. healthy. Yeah. Michael Jackson's go, probably paying the money to this. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to make you a little bit of a lot of weird things. Yeah. Now, then next time, you should be a bug, man. You're an unreal carrot. And then you're a dung beetle. But you roll great shit. Dung beetles are bad. Right you ought to be an engineer, man. You ought to be a beaver. This is the famous Fitzroy Street, which, which they gentrified the upper fire. This used to be a fucking nasty street. I quite like it, though. Yeah, I know. Wow, a really nasty place. We're going past it. Yeah. They went and did a lot of nails. They toilet They couldn't get rid of the aboriginals. They couldn't get rid of the junkies. They couldn't get rid of the... The sort of bastion. They can't get rid of you. And they can't get rid of me. No way. He comes back, he comes back. Oh, King's Grove. Like a park. Like a whatnot. Okay. That's where we go. Oh, wow. Get that rig. Get that rig, buddy. Oh, you Can we get him Barry? Sure I do. Okay, cool, man. One. Oh, yeah. bowl me over. Uh, give it to, can, 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 Astrid, can you do us a favor, please? Can you carry, give us this vase? Can you carry that vase? Where'd you get that, Nick? 
Did you get, uh, yeah. oh, I just have to open up the back. <laughs> Thanks for the, thank you for the, thank you for the lift too. Thanks a lot, darling. Thank you. All right, I'll see you guys. Well, I'm coming after you, Perry. I'm just filming you as you exit. <laughs> Auf Wiedersehen. Record. It's called Sam Gribbles. One, two, one, two.
Air walk. Air walk. Yoga. Air walk. Dog <laughs> Good for, good for what? What do you use good your air walks? Walking on. Good walking, walking on? Walking around the place and bouncing up and down and saying, Really, really Kate? And really, Analog? Really? Really, Sahara? Really, Sahara? Really, Sahara? Oh, here we are in Thailand on our little holiday travel. The plane went slightly astray from Adelaide and we ended up in Thailand, so big day out Thailand, first one. Excellent. It's going down big. And what are we doing here, John? Uh, I'm from obviously having a good time we're we're in Thailand. We're shopping for jewellery that's been made by exploited children. How was your day today, alright? Yeah, we like your city, I've heard so many good things about it. About the legalisation of the marijuana. about the acceptance of homosexuality, about the right for a woman to make free choice and abortion. We love it. We'll be coming back here, I hope, someday soon. We won't forget you, and don't forget about us. We are Pyro!
What do you think you're trying to do, man? Turn that shit off! Where's the naked orgies in the lines of coke? Who knows? It's a myth, it's a myth. This is what backstage is all about. Right. It's a hotel manager at the door. Constantinople. Well, I think that was a very astute political move he made. And uh, house would Rome regain and her girdle. And Freud, what do you reckon? And Freud, uh, a little more humility. Just a little more. The same with Jung. No, Jung. Tesla. Tesla had a fear of hair and wore gloves. <laughs> Big voltage about, things in the Frankenstein movies he invented for the people. Tell me about Edison. He's a fucker. Hey, I really hated him. He conspired with the government to try to pull, uh, rob us, to uh, defeat the good ideas with uh, a fucking fist. I don't believe you. What the fuck are you doing? The new batteries. They are the new batteries working out okay? Yeah? They're doing very well. Oh, I'm glad to hear that. Yeah. <laughs> 
Um, here's a crew member. Kelvin Flanders. Kelvin Flanders. I'm not exactly sure what he does. What do you do, Kelvin? Uh, set things up. He sets and things up. Right. right. Here's another one. Damien Oxley. Damien Oxley. What do, what do you do, Damien? I'm your lighting person. Is it, uh, my lighting person? This Stand is Matt, up. Matt Crosby. He's our Come sound man. Known as and there's another Matt. That's another one of our crew members. And here comes Kai Reinhardt. He does side of stage. Yeah. Absolutely, absolute joy. Scarlet fog, the walls. 
Bottoms of bad black bottom kind They are the sick breath that my hind They are the sick breath that my hind They are the sick breath that my hind They are the sick breath that red at my hind Well I hear stories from the chamber No, I mean, look, in the inter what I'm trying to say, in the interview situation, often you come across as a kind of cornered, uh, cornered rat or something like that. Not a rat in a bad way, but a cornered, you know. Like, That's like, you know, No, I don't mean that in that, I don't mean like you're a rat. I mean like a cornered animal, a cornered animal. Do they get aggressive or do they fucking. They, they cow on the they, they, no, they, machine they, pointed at me and I don't like something to do with it. They hiss back and. Show their teeth. Show their teeth. Yeah. Yeah. Well, what would you like to know? Yeah, no. um, okay. is, I want to know is. My question to you is is size important? I think we've done it like This is for Cleo yes. magazine. It is. It's. Absolutely. Jim, introduce yourself for start, please. Jim What do you do? What's your station in life? Um, well, what do you do in the bad season? I play percussion. Oh. With, your, with your toe. With my toe. You broke. What happened? You broke your foot. I broke two toes. Oh. What, what did you think of the tour? Um. 
that you thought was really good. What do you think? Of, what what, <laughs> what, what um, do you enjoy playing in uh, our band? I love playing in your band. Our band. Our band. You're in it too, yeah. Well, you yeah. know, that's what I said, our band, yeah. Yeah. No. <laughs> Actually, I think it's really, really great. Sincerely. You think we're one of the better bands? Yeah. Without a doubt. Yeah. Although the night was, it was flaccid yet had a terrorist purple mob in the belt. <laughs> Where Sydney was like a fucking gigantic battle wreck here. Melbourne was just magnificent. Britain was touch and go, you know, bit in the underpants. Auckland was, well, just warming up now. And Perth, Perth, you get the same as Perth. Most prematurely at this stage. Yeah, it was mostly a post-coital experience. Yeah. Post-coital. Post-coital nausea. I mean, when you were on stage, I was having a cigarette because I didn't do it with the experience. It was a post-coital experience. How you You're a funny man, Alan. Thank you. Please don't shoot. It was a great tour. Oh, Blixer. Oh, thank you for everything. I see you in a couple of weeks. See you, Blixer. <laughs> Thanks you for everything. Oh, Blixer. Nice it's just going to be uh, Sterling, man. two weeks You're probably Prince. and then we'll Prince start working again. Thank you, everybody. Love you. Blixer. Bye. Farewell. Good job, Bye, Bye, Thomas. Bye, Jim. Farewell. Bye, Farewell. Farewell. Everybody. Farewell. Oh, Warren. Goodbye, Warren. Bye. Bye. See you later. See you in a See you in Where are you going? Way. I'm going home. I'm, I'm going you? back. Hey, see you, Marty. Goodbye. Are you coming? Was a nice hey, tour. Am I going to see you again? Marty, goodbye. Will we see you again, darling? Was a good tour, wasn't it? Kind yeah. of off a holiday. Are you? Are you leaving? Yeah. Well, maybe I'll come to Belgium. See yeah, come to Belgium. Maybe in Brussels. We'll see you talking about the other night. I'll give you a call. Yeah. Take care, my loves. All right. Cut.